um, I want to talk about the importance of the proper shoes when you're doing legs or squats in general. You can also do them barefoot, which is another method. Um, I'm not going to get into it today, but I'm wearing shoes today. So you can see these are the ones that I had on, but for some reason today, they're like rubbing my foot the wrong way inside here. But these are really, really good. Um, I, I wear a lot of these. Uh, I can never say the name. Harachas, Harachi. I was saying Sriracha for a long time, but that's something else. So anyway, I got jokes today. These are really good, and you want to squat or do legs just because of the comfort of the bottom of the foot um, needs to have stability so that you can actually control your movement. And these are like flat, uh, very sturdy, very good for squatting. Um, I do this. I do Converse. These are the ones I'm going to wear today because they give me a lot of stability on my ankle and also the bottom of my foot to control the movement for legs and i also use my vans which are good our converse are really good we'll get more into that later but yeah um now these are shoes that i do my cardio i'm not doing my fasted cardio today um but cardio base movements um high performance uh man something's wrong with my brain today cardio running anything and why i say these just throw one down real quick because i don't got three arms they bend and they make the movement a lot easier when you're doing more of a fast-paced movement. good so this is what i wear actually i wear these a lot on my upper body days because i do infuse a lot more cardio and um faster movements where i can bend and move so yeah movement you can do legs in these, but I will promise you this, your foot will not feel as sturdy compared to a flat, sturdy bottom shoe. These are really good for interval movements, um, high pace running.